Hey guys, GNT here, and I'm back with more Yu-Gi-Oh! Not even gonna say the title. Not even gonna say the title, it's just Yu-Gi-Oh! That's pretty much all we do here now anyway. It's all that matters. Anywho, I came to this abandoned dorm. Because you know, I figured it'd be the perfect place to bring a chick, right? You know? That and or mysteriously vanish. Hmm. You know, you take your chances. Anywho, speaking of vanishing, there's nobody here. Oh, there we go. We got Hyde and Rio. Go Hyde, Rio. Or he day. I'm gonna call him Hyde. Anywho, let's uh, let's let's do the dueling thing, right? <laughs> like I was about to ask you the same thing. And I'm like, oh, cool. He's like, I wasn't talking to you. <laughs> Fine then, tag duel. How about that? Yeah, just gonna go second from now on. Instead of forcing my partner to go first. Because her hand never seems to be suited for the first turn. And then we just end up getting screwed. Ah, flip. I'm still using the Exodia deck. <laughs> I know this is the only deck that has a bunch of normal monsters in it. Really wish I could go first. That'd be great. Oh, she has the Jar of Morphing. Not Morphine. Morphing. With a G at the end. You know? That other stuff is the stuff that that would probably be very fun to have, but um, probably wouldn't help you live longer taking a bunch of it. Oof. Oh, flip. Chainsaw insect. Dope stuff. But will she take the first hit or not? No, she refuses. I feel you on that. Oof. And he brings it back. Like a cheap hooker. But don't worry, for I was destined to have a mirror force as well. He's like, what was that? Ah, oh, flip, I said it out loud. Nothing, don't worry about it. Oh, flip, bottomless trap hole. Hmm. How very unfortunate. Unlike my partner. I'm gonna let the monster go. What is that? Really? You 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 ruined it, sir. I was gonna let this go because I was gonna, you know, get to draw a card. But if you're gonna negate the effects, there's no point in keeping the monster around. So you know, it's what it is. Hmm. That morphic jar would be beautiful right about now. You should play it. You should play that morphic jar. I'm just going to keep saying it until you do it. But you already knew that, didn't you? 
probably another flip effect monster that drains life points. That's what I'm assuming is the face down card on their side. Might be another bird. Great job. All right, what do we got? Burden of the Mighty, yes. There you go. Now, how about this? Look, this morphing jar. Oh, flip, the effects are canceled. Son of a gun, I forgot about that stupid card over there. Gosh darn it, it ruined everything. I could kill you. Well, screw it then, let's just flip everything. Summon this too. Let me see what this is. Flip! It was exactly what I thought it was. Gosh darn it! I do not find this fun. These two suck. They just drained all the fun out of the duel. You put up a card that just stops effects of monsters. Know how excited I was to see that chainsaw insect? It was almost as exciting as seeing Chainsaw Man back in the day when it was good. Before the middle part of it hit. Oh, flip. She's not even playing anymore. She got the crazy card. How about this? Oh, dang it, still a little too strong. It's fine. I'm playing it like that. I'm waiting to start pulling some normal monsters so I can have a crazy hand, you know? Also, the reason why I played that in attack is you know, they probably don't have many monsters that are able to just randomly be summoned that'll be able to beat it. So to usually keep them from attacking multiple times. That's what I was thinking at least. Anywho, partner, do your thing. Ooh. Ooh. That could be fun. She didn't even play it. Never mind. Do I not have a scrap iron scarecrow down there? I thought I said one. Why didn't she use it? What the flip? That doesn't work. There we go. It's my time now. I'm gonna get that out of here. She's really making me want dual solo. It was just that simple. That's all you had to do. Just flip it. Oh, 
It's not gonna work. She's gonna summon it. Yep. I don't think the AI was designed to understand that their effects are being stopped. Like you see, I make the mistake one time and I learn from it. The AI makes the mistake multiple times and doesn't stop the attack so we keep losing life points. Whatever, it's fine. I'm cool, you know, I'm cool. Mm-hmm. Oh, flip. See, because even they played that thing and that they could do something and, you know, effect is done. Not even possible. There we go. We're going to lose one of these next turn anyway, so it's whatever, but, you know. At least I can activate the card. Do the right thing. Wow, that would have actually hurt us rather than them. So glad your effect didn't work. But at least we can do some damage now. I thought I was going to have to wait for it to roll back around to my turn. To do any damage at all. I was hoping this doofus would summon another one of those monsters with super high attack points. And then we've used this bottomless trap hole. But none of that happened. This is how it was supposed to be going the whole time. Flip. I was like, it'd be amazing if I got all the pieces of Exodia right now. Right here, right now. But no, the game was like, yeah, I don't know about all that, sir. Oof. You got two of them? Nope. Yeah, I'm I'm find me a solo duel next. That's what I'm gonna do. It's making us a little stressful. Anywho, that's gonna do it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed this here duel, and I will see you next time on Yu-Gi-Oh! Oh my goodness, Jinzo's here. And with her annoying friend as a partner, son of a gun. Yes, when I know,